Hello everyone. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell so you can get each new video in regards to getting the notification for each new video that I submit. All right, guys, so let's talk about it. Yes, I had to title this video. So who is black enough? I roll, yes, had to do it because I get so sick of this nonsense and it is nonsense trust me when I tell you so black people have been in this country from 1619 to 2020 okay just for a quick history lesson that's 401 years yet and still you have light-skinned black people brown-skinned black people dark-skinned black people literally battling it out about who's black enough as if we don't have much more extreme problems <laughs> outside of worrying about who's black enough. Now, mind you, and let me just say good morning, everybody. It's, it's very early. But mind you now, we have all of these other problems, but we are still worried about the skin tone of the next black person. Not to say it's not important, but we have so much... We have so many more pressing issues than the color of our skin. So, who is black enough? Who can decide who is black enough? First of all, the answer to that question, drum roll please, is no one, okay? No one can decide for another black person if they are black enough or not. And that is wrong. And it needs to stop immediately. I have no right as a light-skinned black person to tell any dark-skinned person or a brown-skinned person, hey, you're not black enough to me. Okay, and <laughs> why does my opinion even matter? Why do you even need my validation? And the same thing goes for dark-skinned people and brown-skinned people. Why do I even care what you have to say? Why do I even need your validation in regards to figuring out if I'm black enough? Not even sure why I would even care. And you shouldn't even care if I had that viewpoint or, or if I felt that way. You shouldn't even care about that, which I don't feel that way because I have common sense. And I'm never going to walk up to another person and be like, Ugh, you like rock music? Ugh, you're not black enough. What? Ugh, you like country music? You're not black enough. You like anime? You're not black enough. No, I'm not going to do that because that's crazy, just to be quite honest. Like, really, it's something's a little wrong. I'm not going to go any further than saying that, but it seems like something's a little off to me. But I'm not going to say anything further than that. Everybody else put two and two together. But I'm not going to walk up to people and because they don't have the same exact thoughts as me or the same exact skin tone as me or they don't look like Wesley Snipes. And God bless that man today. No shade against him. But because they don't look like Wesley Snipes, I say, oh, you're not black because you're not dark as Wesley Snipes. What? <laughs> Excuse me? What? Yes, I have heard that reference be made. It is the most ignorant sugar honey iced tea that I have ever heard. Okay. <laughs> you are not as dark as Wesley Snipes, so you're not black. Okay. All right. You don't have Wesley Snipes' hair texture, so you're not black. Okay. What? <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. It doesn't make sense. And then you'll have certain people that'll ask you if you're black enough. Meanwhile... They will do things that are just bizarre. We'll just say that for, for as being the word. They'll do bizarre things, but then they'll be coming to you, checking you, asking you, are you black enough? Are you sane enough? Because that's the question that you need to be asking somebody that's asking you, are you black enough? Well, are you black enough to be doing that? Are you sane enough to be asking me that question? Because that, like, I don't know, like, it's like people don't have good comebacks in the moment. I got a comeback. <laughs> Are you black enough? Are you sane enough? Because it seems like not. 
it seems like you're a little touched with insanity because it's like really you're literally walking around as a black person asking another black person if they're black enough or telling them and demanding that they accept it that's what's really crazy you're demanding that they accept you saying that they're not black enough then you're getting mad because they're getting offended and having something to say to you and then it's well i i didn't mean it like that yes you did you meant exactly what you said because you said you're not black enough if you listen to rock music if you listen to country i have heard all kind of stupid i have heard some of the most ignorant sugar honey iced tea you could possibly imagine about not being black enough well listen at the way you talk you're not black enough listen at the way that you read you're not black enough okay that doesn't even make sense oh my god you watch those types of movies you're not black enough if you watch musicals i have heard it all trust me (laughs) i have heard above and beyond ignorance okay and this just this doesn't just come from other black people this comes from within the community community excuse me and outside of the community so when it comes to stuff like that i just need y'all to ask people when they ask you are you black enough just flip the script on them and say hey are you sane enough all right guys bye